Hello everyone, so a while back I promised a video about using the TP patch to fix Jazz Jackrabbit. Um, so if you don't know what Jazz Jackrabbit is or why it has to be fixed, here's a little bit of an introduction. So, um, Jazz Jackrabbit is a, uh, I think it's a 90s DOS game. It's a platformer. Um, it is a freaking blast. I highly recommend it if you haven't played it. But it's written in a language called Turbo Pascal, um, which unfortunately does not work well on CPUs above uh, 200 megahertz. So to show you what happens when that, um, when you try to run that in a system with above 200 megahertz, uh, let's try running Jazz here directly. You get a runtime error 200, um, which basically means that it can't allocate memory properly. Um, so the only reason why I'm using VMware is I don't have a capture card that works with my DOS machines anymore. That ship has long since sailed. So, um, I'm just going to have to use VMware for now, I suppose. Um, so in order to run the TP patch, first you obviously got to download it and you got to have a copy of Jazz Jackrabbit, but you can fetch it off of the Jazz 2 Online website. Highly recommend it, that's a good site. Um, Got lots of good people there too. So you're gonna want to go into the TP, the TP patch folder wherever you extracted it to. Type in TP patch um, and then point it to your jazz.exe file. So it's written in German, so I can't really understand most of it. But basically, it just says that it's successfully copied the or it's successfully edited the binary files. Um, so let's go to jazz. First, we want to run setup because we're in VMware. Exit and save. So, as you can see here, Jazz is working pretty much how it should. Now, I'm going to see here in a second there are some glitches that are related to VMware being stupid, but um, because it doesn't use a standard graphics. Uh, standard graphics setup. VMware SVGA is very, very temperamental with DOS stuff. But... We've got PC speaker sound. We've also got Approaching Nirvana in the background. They're fucking amazing. Alright guys, so I think that'll do it for this video. It's just going to be an extremely quick one. just wanted to show you how to use the TP patch to uh, fix your software. Thank you all. Have a nice day.